Texas DA and his wife were found dead last night. Mike McLelland and his wife were killed in their home. One official said a door was kicked in and there were bullet casings everywhere. Joining me now from Kaufman County, Texas, is Ed Lavendera. Ed, what have you heard? Any suspects at this time? No suspects at this point. Very little information has been released about uh, as regarding the murder of Mark McClellan and his wife Cynthia in their home. Uh, they were discovered in, in their home uh, late yesterday. And of course, this raises all sorts of questions here in Kaufman County because almost exactly two months ago, uh, one of uh, Mr. McClellan's assistant prosecutors here in Kaufman County, a man by the name of Mark Hassey, was also murdered in a brazen attack as Hassey was walking uh, to his office uh, at, the, uh, at the courthouse. It was a, an attack where no arrests have been made. There had been uh, re reports that perhaps uh, investigators were looking into the, that it might have been the work of a white supremacist group and, and that sort of thing. But all of this raising very serious questions as to whether or not uh, someone is targeting public officials here in Kaufman. County and whether or not the murder of the DA and now the, the now DA and an assistant prosecutor almost two months ago might be connected. What is interesting is Mark McClellan had been very outspoken about the hunt for the killer of his assistant prosecutor. Listen to the way he talked about that hunt just two months ago after he had learned about the death of his co-worker. I hope that the people that did this are watching because we're very confident that we're going to find you, we're going to pull you out of whatever hole you're in, and we're going to bring you back and let the people of Kaufman County prosecute you to the fullest extent of the law. Anything that you people can do to accelerate uh, our getting our hands on this scum will be appreciated. Strong words two months ago from the district attorney here in Kaufman County, and now investigators here are investigating his murder and the murder of his wife. So obviously, Susan, this is a, a case and an ongoing case that has a lot of people uh, on edge in these areas. Susan? It is so new, Ed. We're going to be checking back later in the morning for any updates. Thanks so much.